What's up, y'all? I don't know if this is actually a what's up, y'all, so much as it is a, just a wild-ass reflection that I know lots of people are having, but I just feel like I need to name that I find it wild um, that the Republicans are out in these streets like, you know, uh, 18 is too young to vote, right? Because Gen Z came and handed them their asses in the midterms. While every day refusing to do shit, including raise the age on on what it takes to get a gun license. It's like you can go and be killed overseas for your country at 18. You could um, go and pick up a gun and just walk into a LGBTQ plus nightclub in Colorado and kill a bunch of people or in Florida and kill a bunch of people or a movie theater and kill a bunch of people or a church and kill a bunch of people. And we have no intentions to say that you need to be above 18 to have access to fucking deadly weapons and kill people. But you need to be older than 18 to vote. At this point, if you have people or if you are a person who is still supporting the Republican Party. And don't get me wrong, this isn't even a conversation about the fuck shit that is the Democratic Party. The United States political system is trash. However, the amount of intentional cognitive dissonance that one has to engage in to have a conversation that says, maybe 18 is too young to vote, but it's totally fine for murder. Something's really, really wrong. Something's, it's not, it's not even like something's wrong in the sense that there is some deep internal moral miscalculation that has a person only be interested in power. That's what's wrong is like, there is no other relationship to humanity except for the relationship of power over. And if that is the place where you are following or that is the place where people that you love continue to follow, I think you have to ask yourself some really critical questions about how you can navigate your own morality and hold those positions. And again, that doesn't mean you can't have compassion for those people, but accountability and compassion are not mutually exclusive. I just needed to say that because I'm just like my brain just keeps continues to like explode with confusion. Um, yeah, and it enrages me. And I'm sending so much love to all the victims um, of that shooting in Colorado Springs and all of the victims of the horrific mass shootings that happen in the United States on a daily basis and the deep sense of of disconnection from one's humanity that must exist for this to continue to happen and for the people who have the ability to change it to refuse to. I'm praying for their souls.